Hello, 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 hello. How are you all? How are we all doing? I will say happy new month. Yes, happy new month. Okay, this is February. Yes, 2023. I'm here doing this video. You know, it's a very, very, very simple but important. Okay, it's just gonna be a very short video. But before that, I just want to come to you to say if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please kindly do LM Atin. And also, you can follow me on Facebook. You can follow me on Facebook, LM Atin. And follow me on Instagram, LM Atin1. And TikTok, LM Atin. Okay? On YouTube, don't forget to press notification bell because you don't want to miss any video coming from me. Okay? You don't want to miss any because. I'm here to share a lot of nuggets to people this year. Whether it's something to do with business, because on our channel, we talk about business, we talk about economy, we talk about lifestyle, we talk about health, you name it, okay? On our channel, The Billionaire Queen Corner, okay? So now, I'm coming to you to record this video just to tell you the importance of medical checkup okay the importance of medical checkup when last did you go to your doctor to check your health when last have you gone to the hospital for a checkup you don't need to go to the hospital just because you are sick because what other people do they will wait until when they are very very sick or they have seen a sign of something before they can go for a checkup. Those things are wrong. Okay? Those are very, very wrong. So definitely you have to go and check yourself. Okay? I will tell you. There are certain sickness or there are certain disease that you will not see the sign yeah there are so many diseases that you will not see the sign okay things like cancer there are certain diseases cancer is one of them you will not see the sign or you will not even feel the sign so the best way is to go for health checkup is very very important very very important okay general check I will give you one example why I'm doing this video this happened to one of my neighbors yeah where I used to live before one day we woke up we didn't hear anything anymore. I'm like, ah, my neighbor normally is a very lively person. You know, definitely in the morning I will know that yes, she's awake or she's like she's there. Do you get my point? But that day I didn't really hear anything. Like the whole day I didn't hear anything. So I was wondering, I even called her phone. There was no response. So it's later later the daughter called me back and said the mom is in the hospital like in the night they had to call ambulance to come and take their mom to the hospital because she was not responding and the condition is very bad i'm like ah, what happened like she was very fine said yeah so later, later, she was in the hospital for like three months. After that, you know, even me seeing her in the hospital was really a heartbreaking thing because she doesn't, she's not the person that I used to know. She doesn't look like the person that I used to know. All of a sudden, she lost weight. All of a sudden, her hair and everything was gone. So they told her that she have cancer, but because she has already you know, she had the cancer for some time in her body. Yeah? She had it already a lot in her body. Because she lost all her hair, everything. Okay? She lost all her hair. 
So she continued being in the hospital. That three months passed, four months passed, five months passed. The six month, they told us you only have a few days to leave. And definitely she passed on. You know? And that thing has been on my head since then. And that is not only that. There are so many people who are just going like that. There are certain I know that death we cannot it's not something you can prevent if the time comes. We all gonna go someday. Okay? But there are certain things that we can do as well for us to still stay longer. Okay? So we have to go for checkup very, very early. It's very, very important that we have to go and check to see everything when it's just starting. So we don't have to leave it until when it deteriorates all over the body. And then we now start rushing to go and seek for help. And that time it will be late. So the best thing to do is now. So try and go and check yourself. Go for medical checkup. It, you don't need to be sick for you to go for medical checkup. Things like high blood pressure, things like blood sugar, things like BMI, things like, you know, it's better you go and check. Things like, for, especially for those who they stay abroad, things like vitamin D, for we that we come from Africa, yes, this country like the weather is different from our weather back home that we had sunshine everywhere. So here, the weather here is very, very cold. So definitely you need vitamin D and a lot of us suffer from that here. Things like iron and all that. So you see that you have to be on tablet and things like that. So the best thing is go for medical checkup when it's early don't leave it too late and save yourself so if you like this video please kindly share it with everybody so that everybody will go and check themselves maybe every three months or every six months or twice a year i think that it is better and it will be good so thank you so much don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow us on Facebook, Ellen Atim. Follow me on Instagram, Ellen Atim One, and TikTok, Ellen Atim. So thank you so much. Enjoy the video. Bye.